Respiratory therapists have played a major role in the fight against COVID, and this week the job and the people who did it are being recognized during Respiratory Care Week. WLKY's Jennifer Bayless talked with two U of L health therapists who say COVID has transformed their job. We've dealt with ventilator shortages, um, supplies not being here, um, and ultimately our patients um, being the sickest that they possibly have ever been. The coronavirus pandemic has been a constant battle for healthcare professionals like UofL Health Respiratory Therapist Makara Durbin and Jessica Christensen. And we've had some very busy trauma seasons here at U of L um, since I've been here. And no, we've never been through anything like this before. Respiratory therapists treat problems with lungs or breathing. And with COVID being a respiratory disease, the profession has been on the front line of the pandemic from the very beginning. So we check the ventilators, make sure your patients are stable on the ventilators, all the readings are correct, make sure that they are not struggling, make sure they're comfortable. Durbin says the pandemic has redefined respiratory therapy. One of the most difficult adjustments has been helping families say goodbye. Being there for your patient and you're all garbed up in your N95 mask. You have on a full shield of your face, a hairnet, gloves, gown, all the things. And you're holding your patient's hand while the nurse is holding an iPad as a fam with family on it. That's, it's hard to even realize that this is what we're living in right now, where family has to say goodbye over an iPad. Despite everything, Durbin and Christensen are grateful for the ability to help people. They appreciate the recognition the pandemic and respiratory care week has brought to the profession. Just seeing them overcome an illness, it, it solidifies that I'm here to do the right thing and I'm here for a purpose. And it helps out so much tremendously. And that's what keeps a lot of us going. Absolutely. Yeah. It's, it has been a true honor to be of service to our patients. Jennifer Bayless, WLKY 